meteorologist Tom Patton. Very happy Monday afternoon to you folks. It's a nice day. Typical summer afternoon. We've got some sun coming in. We had some showers this morning. There'll be a few more this afternoon. Not everybody will see that. Hey, a lot of folks were grateful. I got a lot of comments on Facebook about how happy they were to get some rain this morning. Ludenburg, Prince George, parts of Chesterfield County, Tri-Cities, Dinwiddie. All right, let's talk about what's happening out here. This afternoon, as I mentioned, it's a hot one. Temperature should be 90, and that's pretty much where I'm going with the forecast today, 90. Upper 60s, probably about where we'll land tonight. So pretty normal, pretty average today. 101, the record back in 1954 and 53 back in 1976. It's hard to imagine the middle of July dropping to 53 degrees. Isn't that crazy? It may have been like some kind of hurricane or something. I can't, I don't know exactly what happened there. Sunrise is now, we're moving back up almost six o'clock again and setting earlier at 831 this evening. All right, good. 85 degrees is our current. Light winds out of the north. The dew point is 66, not too oppressive, but the percentage of humidity is fairly high because our temperature is just a little bit lower today. High of 90 degrees. Uh, we'll just stay in the upper 80s to around 90 for about four or five hours. Then we'll drop back to the 70s into the evening hours. And overnight tonight, probably about upper 60s to about 70 should do it for your low tonight into tomorrow morning. So not too bad. Again, I'll repeat that. All right, here's a look now where we are. I think I got a good graphic. If we can jump to my computer now. Is that what I have? Do I have the right graphic up? Yeah, this is our highs for the past two weeks. And here's why I wanted to show you this. Look how uniform. Our differential has been about six to, yeah, six degrees. Now, 85 on the far right is where we are now. We'll hit about 90 today. But look at our high of 94, a low of 88. That is a summertime pattern, if I've ever seen one, where our range is only six degrees over a two week time frame. If I showed you this in March, April, May, these numbers would be all over the map. You'd have some 20, 25 degree differences. But just a six degree temperature range on our daytime highs over the past couple weeks. I find that fascinating. You might care less at home, but I think it's cool. All right, well, I'm showing you that because we're gonna to jump to about 96 come Thursday, but that still stays within that six degree range. All right, here's a look at those showers this morning moving off the Eastern shore. Uh, if you've got family at the beaches, looking good down there, they'll see increasing sunshine from Nags Head up to Sandbridge. And there's a little boundary right here that came through this morning and it's gonna stay around and maybe even move a little bit inland as a stationary front. The best chances for strong thunderstorms today are south and southeastern Virginia. As we go into the afternoon, that's where the bulk of the showers will be. But look how there may be a couple little spots here and there. So as I say, that's the favorite area. There could still be a few spots into the afternoon hour. So we'll just kind of keep an eye on that today from five to six, seven, eight o'clock this evening. And then they'll lose their uh, intensity with the, the sun going down today. 90s for the week, 60s and 70s at night. Better chances for thunderstorms starting Friday through the weekend. That's it, Cheryl. Back to you.